Well, hello everyone, what is going on? It's the Young Man's Jeff, and we're here with episode 27 of Assassin's Creed for Black Flag. In the previous episode, we wrapped up all the rest of our work outside of the Animus in Abstergo Entertainment, uh, basically picking up the last of the post it notes and hacking the rest of the computers we had available to us. We re entered the Animus to find ourselves in Nassau with the. Um, the area outside being blocked by the British Brigade, I guess, who have come to offer pardons to pirates who want to, you know, stop the business, receive royal pardons, to which uh, Hornigold and uh, two of his men seemed quite interested in the idea, whereas uh, Vane and Rackham, thankfully, are uh, seeing through the plot. Now, uh, obviously, we finished the episode by sort of tailing them as they were discussing this and getting into the fort and basically hearing what they were what they had to say and I said that I wanted to get us to the smuggler den this episode but apparently whilst this brigade is still surrounding Nassau we can't fast travel out so unfortunately we are going to have to continue on the main story a little bit longer but um, let's see there's <laughs> a guy passed out the floor it's fine all right so we have the gunpowder plot look at him turn cold Makes me bloody ill to think on how many times I've put up with Horny Gold and his self-righteous shite. Verily, you are a man of principle, Captain Horny Gold. A man I believe I can trust with my best ideas. Faith and we'll survive this, Charles, with our pride intact. Well, that's confidence. If you brewed a plan, I might get a taste of. Nassau is over, that's plain to see. I say we skip out tonight and regroup at my compound. Fair enough, what's your angle? The Brits have brought their supplies ashore, see? If we nick some gunpowder and pine pitch, we can build a fire ship and send it straight at the blockade, blasting it to smithereens. Aye. We'll use Rackham's ship. You're in a capable captain. My conscience is clear. Right. When you get the gunpowder, I'll secure the pine pitch. Okie dokie, I kill four guards in one kill street, that's easy, blood point guards. Well they're both easy, I just hate how to use my supplies, but alright. Uh, let's see, we'll get the kill street done first, I think. Come on everybody. You there, stop hold you. Let's have a go. Okay. Okay. Magical teleporting gunpowder. Hey, right. fellas. Try and get some more. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Okay, now just. Uh, wait, was it to kill guards or to. Just on the guards, okay. That should be too big a deal. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, so I think we'll, I know this, uh, there's four memories to this sequence. So, I know there's, I think, there's probably a, a few memories. Okay, 
Okie doke. Hmm. Oh, no, yeah. You saw nothing. Steal this. Boom. Literally. <laughs> right. Wouldn't need to do it at this point, but it's just for fun. Just for funsies. So you get for getting in my face. Okie dokie. So yes, this is probably gonna be two back to back memories, I think. If this is um what part we're collecting the um, gunpowder? I think there's like another part where we're actually going to be using it on the on the uh, brigade. So stand still, stand still. There you go. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna ring your bloody bell. See if I can. See if I can. Oh, no, no, you don't. Are you done? Alright, come on then. Hey, I can't see, bloody bitch. Of our dance back. One dart, wow. Cheers. Oh. This guy got nine. He's got two. Oh, well. not too bad. Okay. Boom. One more to go. You got any? Gosh, yeah. Why would you? Stop there. Nope. Oh. Come at me. Hey. No, that's not who wanted you to attack. Honestly. No. Hey. Does she left me on pal? Some ammo. Another two. Come on, you can do better than that. Ah! Hmm? Who's this? Oh, you. Yeah. Rat right, bastard. Come here. Oh, 
You got ammo? Do you? Anybody? Anyone at all? Any ammo? What sort of? Be all. Yep, memory two. She has. Okay. Awesome. Uh, let's just see here. We can't even fast travel on the island we're on. It's a bit rude. But fine. Goes off a little bit, won't I? Oh, courier. Oh, he might have some uh, sleep guns. Hello. I know, I can't be bothered. <laughs> that lasted well. Commodore 86. Come on, boys, you're lagging. That's this bloody hand. Lieutenant. Hi, sir. The Commodore fears a revolt is nigh. His orders are to sink every goddamn pirate ship now anchored in that harbor tonight. It's by the governor's wishes, sir. This is a direct order, soldier. You will take position on the grounded galleon and await the Commodore's further orders. Is that clear? Aye, sir. The conniving bastard. Someone ought to slit the Commodore's throat before he gets a chance to bar those orders. You think so? We're dead in the water otherwise. All right, I'll kill him. Your brains are baked. I won't take no part in killing the Commodore. Not one of the King's men. We can't risk our good fortune. I'll be waiting for you. Oh, that sneaky bastard. Oh, bloody tail. Okay, well... Okay, okay. Let's get through our incidents. Get over. You can't see me. Lots of sour blood between them two, Rogers and Chamberlain. What's the issue? The Commodore don't think much of the millions there. Hey, 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 hey. Rogers is some kind of Jacobite, or worse, that he's a Catholic. Oh, 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 I could think the worst. Got another two men there. I've got a gun! You lads, follow and lay aboard. The Commodore has a job for you. Hi, sir! Everybody going. Doesn't seem to be anyone that's isolated. I heard the Commodore ranting and raging about Woods Rogers, calling him a hippie man. What's happened to set them to us? man, you don't want the governor's ire brought down on you. He's a mistake. Well, I'm much more afraid of the Commodore in truth. He's a serious chap, no sense of humor. Hmm, I don't know how long this turn is going to go, so... Hmm. Ah, okay. I can still see him, they're in my sights. Quick, they're getting out my zone. Yeah, my zone. Come on, come on. Hmm. 
try and get that guard down there. Find somewhere to get down first. That'll do. Take positions and prepare to decamp on the Commodore's order. Huh? Okay. Well done. Congratulations, you played yourself. Well, there's plenty of opportunities for stalking kills area. I didn't think we'd be that lucky. Especially at this point of the game. Hmm. More prime guys, please. Right, this isn't going terribly. Oh, no, I don't have an act. <laughs> oh, there he is. Wait, what? What do you mean? I, I've killed three. We got four, if anything. Oh, what was the cupboard on? Uh, air assassinate. Okay, that's uh, that's doable. Need another stalking zone kill, apparently. A lot of BS because I definitely have I've had four I think. Oh no, okay. A bit distracted it seems. See, I don't know why did the first one count. Oh. The others, I don't understand. Okay, whatever. I'm done with you now. No, you saw nothing. You saw nothing. I'm gonna kill your snaky ass leader. That was it. It's all she wrote. Quickly, if everyone sees us. Oh, 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 there you go. Well done. You don't have to clear nothing, pal. You need to be an awkward bugger, didn't you? Oh. Watch yourself. Get next to me, boy. Go away. Please. There we go. And good night. The governor's given us a pardon, Commodore. Don't a man's word mean anything in these times? A syphilis clouded your mind. Why scratch and claw to protect such squalor? Your parasites feeding off the industry of honest men. Much like King George in that respect. Know your place, peasant! You may have taken my life, but you have not improved your own by any measure. Does some purpose keep you talking? <sighs> if not for that heathen, Governor Rogers, I'd have seen you hanged from your own cross trees. Worm. All of you. Sorry, was he talking? That all I heard is a lot of hissing. You know what I mean? From the absolute snake. Okay, well. That's my job done. Come at me all you want. Let's see if I care. I'm, I'm, I'm done. Your boss is dead. I don't see why you're still having to go, to be honest with you. Bye. <laughs> I'm throwing bombs into the water. How stupid are you? In fact, yeah, don't answer that. Okay, uh, where are we going? Where's the memory? On the absolute opposite side, and let me guess. I'm not going to be able to fast travel over there, am I? I'm going to have to walk. Like some kind of peasant. At least on the way, I'm going to be able to pop into a shop and uh, restock on 
sleep gas before I forget. So I will forget. As you can hear, my PS4 is having a whale of a time today. It absolutely loves this game. In fact, it loves every game that it plays. Stop you! Rarely does it have a game where it doesn't express its absolute love. Go away. Why are you still following me? Oh, oh, that's it. You just made it personal, pal. Could do a nice, clean, easy kill with the blade, with my, uh, my sword. But you've hurt me. You've hurt my feelings. Okay, just to double check, we, we, we can't flash off the camera. Yeah. Got that. But you know what? While we're in the shop, we'll um, top up on our right fit and um, sword, why don't we? It's been a while. Obviously, we've um, got all the guns and treasures at this point. Uh, this forward, make sure we're stocked on sleep darts. Yep. Kind of getting tired of the um, outfit more than anything. But first of all, we're going to get to the British Colonial Cutlasses, a pair of cutlasses popular among the settlers of the British colonies in North America. And so we lose the speed, we get one in combo. Damage remains the same. Okay. Outfits. We're going to get the privateer outfit, a sleep back outfit, very common among privateers throughout the West Indies. Okay. Any more outfits we have, actually, to buy at least? Um, it's just the. Th Okay. Good day. I Good hope day. I see you well. So that's like a regular looking outfit I get right now, rather than like the, the scrugs. Alright, look at that. That's actually quite a cool outfit. It's been a while since I've had one that I've actually really liked. But, uh, the very last I have one. Quick, quick, quick enough. I've usually got a hood as well, so it doesn't look as odd in the cutscenes when he intends to lift the hood in his robe, but it doesn't actually have one. So just lifts the air around it. But. Okay, donkey. At least Nassau isn't as big as one would think it is. I seem to be able to get across in no time. But I just I, I miss the open seas. Yes, I do, I do. I don't know how long this memory's gonna be. Hopefully not too long. Hopefully we can get it all done. Nicely within the next uh, seven minutes or so. But here we are, the final memory of sequence seven, the fire ship. Commodore's dead, are we ready? We're close. We've got a problem with the galleon. There's a couple of dozen. Bloody hell. You'd raise a cloud here, louts. You shot on enough gunpowder to blow New Providence off its rocks. Stay off me, mate. I'm, I'm well chafed. As I was telling. Squad of lobsters has commandeered our galleon. We're gonna have to clear it out before we use them cannons to blow the brocade. Bloody hell, issue after issue. Alright, guess we're reclaiming our galleon. Of course we bloody are. Fine. <laughs> but to be out in the open seas, these bloody pirates. The way the pirates, the bloody British, I hate the British. What do we need? Stay near the fire ship, Captain. Keep it afloat. Oh, okay. Use the motor to sink right ships and use the boss to sink a ship. Okay. The Royal Phoenix. It's not got a lot of health on it, has it? The Brits are on to us. Look there. Okay, third fire. time. It's because of this guy. The enemy is the Royal right Phoenix, as it is been so those are the names. This time we got destroyed by nothing at all. Okay, one more mortar. Take the shots Again, optional is done. Before I get anywhere you know, taking these guys down, make sure that you're right next to that ship. Otherwise, again, you're going to be next to this ship. It's 
for the cross. You abandoned the Phoenix? It's like, no, I didn't abandon the Phoenix. Look what you'll find happened is that it wandered off in the middle of a fight. Well, it is good at avoiding mortars, just, just not my own. <laughs> Enemies' mortars are sure. this way. Okay, don't collide with me. I know that you, you, you're dumb enough that you will probably end up doing that anyway. What do you to do? I'm going to these lot now. We're going to eliminate all these ships before you get there. Oh, is this what you... I think that's actually where he's, he's, he's driving the fire ship into. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, 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 Down you go. I have no need of frigates, so I'm not good to board you. Oh, oh, what a way we go. Out to sailor's deep. <laughs> uh, we're home free. Finally. A mighty mess there. <laughs> Burn your bastards! <laughs> the burden of your ass, governor! Prancing about like they took a prize. And there we go. Beautifully done. Beautifully done. And that is the end of another mem another uh, sequence. Thankfully, we're not going to get booted at the Animus this time, though. We've got a little bit of a break before we get back to that. I think for another three sequences or so. The Hammer Falls. It's probably going to boot us back into um, another cutscene, startup sequence 8, I should think. We'll see. Kid, you missed quite a time. Aye. Pity about Nassau and Blackbeard flying the coop. Well, we'll see about Thatch. Vane's off to see him now, and I'm following soon. This is what's left of your experiment in democracy. Aye. We do as we please here, and we take our time doing it. For Christ's sake, Edward. Don't anything but the stink of riches wrinkle your nose. What's got into you, man? Reality, mate. Reality. See that you ain't pulled into the drink by this drowning rat. Oi! I've lived longer than most men who trod this path.
well, well, well. There we have it. We're free. Free from those damn Brits. And uh, where's the next memory? Where are we have to go? Probably about Savannah. No, nope. bit. Wait, that's, that's very far north. Okay, uh, it's gonna be a while before we get to that anyway. Uh, I think we're actually would do a, a good collectible sesh, especially considering I wasn't expecting us to finish sequence seven so quickly. Um, so I think what the plan is gonna be for the rest, well, until we've done it, we'll get the smugglers den, and I've been saying that for about four or five episodes now, but we'll get it done, definitely this time. Can we fast travel? Gonna fast travel? Make a fast travel, yep, we'll definitely get it done. Uh, we'll clear out the Navassa region, and then head over here, and take over the Contoya fort, so we've just got that area done. And then we'll have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five regions left to complete. Which I think is about fair. Still with this bugger. He's still here. The still needs to find another royal convoy to get rid of that one. Although obviously I've not really had a lot of time to go hunting. So but yeah, let's have a look. So progress checker is fifty nine percent of the way through the game, sixty percent through the main sequence. Obviously last time we well today we finished off Secret 7, so we've done the gunpowder plot. Here we go, there's a hefty supply of gunpowder in preparation for his escape from Nassau. Commodore eighty sixth. Edward decides to assassinate Peter Chamberlain before the Commodore can issue his orders to sink the pirate ships and the fire ship Edward and Charles Vane put their plane in motion, destroy the British blockade and escape Nassau. Uh, 68% of the way through side missions, 65% collectibles, 42% of side activities. Uh, Jetdoor upgrades I haven't changed, Jetdoor upgrades obviously we picked up a new sword. Crafting move can't do yet. Protect the challenge is 71 done, that's not too bad. Database. Let's have a look. Beat up nothing at all. Okay, fair enough. Fifty nine percent of the way through the main through the um total sink. Just pause and read if I have a look at these stats. Okay. Found a bit dozy. So there we go, that's what we're gonna do for today. As I said, in the next episode we'll get working on picking up some collectibles and clearing out some locations. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did be sure to like and subscribe, and also be sure to share the video and I will see you guys in episode twenty eight. Bye guys.